Horse, please. No, it's really a uh, horse. It's hard to dodge stuff with you up my ass. Okay, no, we're good. We're good, right? There you go. Just giving me a seahorse enema. Kind of rude. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Cuphead. Now, some of you guys might remember that last episode kind of broke me. Specifically, the two hours that I had spent beating that one dragon boss made me so salty. So I've taken a little bit of time away, I've recharged, I've gathered myself, and fortunately we got through it. I had to stop talking for a little while, but we got through it, and we got through all of Inkwell Isle 2. So today, we're starting off on Inkwell Isle 3, where I'm sure there won't be a bunch of ridiculous bosses waiting for me in high-rise apartment buildings and shaky little townhouses. This is a cool little world. I'm really liking the music. It's very swingy, very jazzy. We have a little pirate lass over here. Ooh, look at you and your fancy moves. What are you up to? Arr, you're gonna need some tips if you wanna keel haul these dead beats. Start by mixing up your weaponry. Can't expect all your arms to work the same on every foe. Mix and match land lubbers. That's what I say. Oh, that's right. Actually, I was going to show you guys last time I unlocked charge and I never actually used it. People were saying that I can change out pea shooter as well, but I feel like it's just the best long range weapon for me. It's just all around good. It doesn't have any drawbacks, but it's fine. It's average. That's what I want. I'd rather have one special and one regular. And we have our super and the best charm, so we should be good to continue. We can't go over the bridge. We have a, uh, you know what, let's try out the boat. We have Captain Briny Beard in shootin' and lootin'. Now I don't usually take advice from strange pirate women, but I was told to change up my weaponry. So we're gonna use charge exclusively because now I can show it to you guys for the first time. And it's not doing any damage. It usually does damage. Do I need to shoot you? Oh, no, you can hit me. You guys can see though, I can fire off a big shot or a little shots and I need to hold to charge it up. Oh, I need to hit you. Okay, that makes far more sense. And I should be parrying this uh, uh, vomit. I don't know, he's squeezing the wildlife at me. It's kind of rude. <laughs> but I'm doing so much damage right now and he's catcalling me. Why did, why did he cat call me? That's kind of rude. Oh, he was calling a shark. Of course he was. Well, you know what? How about you have one of those? <laughs> I'm happy that he wasn't sexually harassing me and was instead having a shark eat my ass. Oh, oh, okay, and you spit. That's cool. I, I didn't see you chewing there. Silly me. What's he calling for now? Oh, the shark coming back. I'm okay. I know where to hit him now. Holy crap. I did really good for a first attempt. Let's try that again. I think I can get him second try now that I know where to actually shoot him from the get-go. Bring it on, you scurvy dog. I know your weakness now. It's the gentle caress of sea life. <laughs> as well as being shot in the body, who would have guessed? So, I just need to try to get as many of these parries as possible because you get a lot of ults off against this guy. I almost have one right away. I don't know if charge gives you an ult faster or not, but it sure feels like it because I got one ready right now. Oh no. The stupid things are gonna hurt me. Oh no, never mind, we're good. Timed it just right. So he's whistling for somebody. Who, who's he got coming? Oh, it's you. Okay, you die in like one hit. I feel like charge might be a little bit overpowered for this game. <laughs> we could just keep hitting him and uh, dodging the, the spit, uh, the cannonballs. I don't think that's how cannons work, but sure, why not? Who's he whistling for now? Who's coming? Oh, it's the shark, okay. Shark coming, I saw him in the background. I'm gonna be over here. Uh, my ass is not on the menu. You can take one of, uh, no, 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 don't blink into him. You're supposed to use your ultimate. Yes, that's the stuff. <laughs> Rainy at sea today. And here we go, good parry. Take that. I think we're doing good. Oh, I was gonna say what's wrong with uh, the boat. It looks very upset. Um, 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 okay. This is very different. What you doing? Oh! We're good. What was that? It just like fired its laser at me and I managed to get a shot off just in time. I almost died there, holy crap. Okay, second attempt. That was a cool boss. I'm not gonna get a very high grade, I don't think. Maybe an A minus? Okay, we're off to a good start this episode. I'm feeling much less salty despite fighting on sea. The sole contract of Captain Brinybeard. Okay, Captain Sauce takes down Captain Brinybeard and I get myself a ship. 
and then I'm pretty sure this bridge is clear. I didn't finish all of the run and gun levels in the last world because I, I just, I don't really care. I'd rather face off against the bosses. I wouldn't mind getting up to that mausoleum and getting a new ultimate. What do you have to say, Mr. Turtle? You boys think your situation is multicolored mess, don't you? But what if I told you there was a way to see in shades of gray, a way that only a pacifist platformer would be able to perceive? Would you violent little mugs believe me if I told you that? I wonder. Yeah, if you beat the game doing nothing but the pacifist route, then you unlock a black and white mode. Doesn't really interest me all that much. We have uh, another ship over here, and then we can't go up. Okay, let's try this one. I do know that there were uh, two more bosses below me, right? The house and the apartments, but I'm, I'm willing to make this a, a C episode. Kayla Maria in High Seas Hijinks. I'm almost afraid to ask what we're gonna get. Oh, a plane level? It's the mermaid, yes! This is one of the just most iconic enemies in the game, I feel like, right? Uh, she's spitting a lot of puffer fish at me. Oh, okay, okay, no, calm down. She's got a lot of, she spits pirates. No, she spits pirates, she summons puffy fish. Okay. She was one of the big reasons why I wanted to play the game originally, because she was one of the highly demoed bosses very early on in, like, developing this game. It's hard to talk and think at the same time. Okay, here, uh, how about this? You can have a bomb right on your tits. How, how about that? You like that? Gotta go for the, what was that little horse doing? Oh, oh, okay, no, no. Oh, the horse doesn't hurt me. It's just making it hard to, to plane. Okay, we're good. Oh my God, you throw so much stuff at me. Stop laughing, woman. Okay, we're, we're gonna hit that. We're gonna hit that. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is madness! Give me another, give me another, yes, there we go. Right on your titties, there we go. How do you feel about that? Okay, no, 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 I don't like the ghosts. That random little mind turtle. What? <laughs> he just bit her. Uh, uh, what, what, no, no. Oh, I can break out of it and I can kill the eels. If they turned her into a Medusa, holy, holy crap, no, 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 that is cheap. That is so cheap. Okay, how about this? I, I don't think I can save up for an ult. I need to kill the eels. They're, they're hurt. That was so funny. <laughs> they got like a good mouthful of her sides and turned her into some kind of supercharged Medusa. Holy crap, dodging this is really difficult. Stop, stop turning me into a statue, please. Okay, here, just eh, and eh. We good? Come on, I don't know how many forms you have, but this has to be a pretty close to- Oh, come on! <laughs> That's really hard! Ooh, we got really far again. Okay, yeah, like, you have to kind of jiggle to break out of it, and if something hits you in that time, the- What can you do? This is exactly what I wanted from this boss. It is just super iconic. I think they were showing how she was animated really early on in development. That's how a lot of people know of her. So she is uh, Kayla Maria. Very cool. <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing her get bit again. <laughs> Those eels, man, it's so good. So she summons a lot of, oh no, not the horse. Horse, please, no, it's really a uh, horse. It's hard to dodge stuff with you up my ass. Okay, no, we're good. We're good, right? There you go. Just giving me a seahorse enema, kind of rude. So the mine turtle is back. There we go, okay. And I wanted to get in for an alt right on the forehead. There we go. That's fine, we're still doing damage. I wanna parry, but I don't wanna take damage. Oh, she's moved on. <laughs> this scream is so good. Okay, so now, yeah, and I gotta break loose as quickly as possible. I kinda wanna save for an ultimate. I feel like that would probably kill all of the eels. Oh my God, okay, ah, uh, no, oh, that's rude. Okay, yeah, the eels took off. They knew what was best for them. So as soon as they come back, I'm gonna, oh, there we go, there we go. I can probably kill all of them right now, right? Boop. Look at all the little eel bits. Oh, I got her. Um, um, what, what, ah, uh, ah, uh, what are we doing now? Oh God, it's like one of those like tunnel helicopter games now. I just need to focus on Cuphead. I only have one health left. Crap, crap, oh, come on. So now she sends out a wave that petrifies you. So freaking close, I will get your floating head. 
I can remember when I first saw her, I thought, how are they gonna have a giant mermaid attack you? And I really like that she summons a bunch of different wildlife, like even, uh, e even uh, her hair is an octopus. It's really hard to talk and think at the same time. It's a, uh, oh, I was gonna say, it's not a very healthy octopus, but it, it seems to be doing okay. It's only dead when she isn't doing something. And she can kind of combo the wildlife together, like the horse enema and the firefish, to make your life really difficult. <laughs> so I definitely don't want like a three combo. Okay, so now probably ghosts, right? She seems to really like the ghosts and the mind turtle together because that's really hard to dodge. And then you know what? You can have one of these right in the eyes. There we go, that's the stuff. And then the puffy fish. Okay, we can parry here. It's hard to tell which one is pink and which one isn't. Uh oh! <laughs> Love it, so good. Okay. So, I just need to not get hit while I'm petrified, and we'll be able to get out of this. I don't know if it's worth killing. I think it is, because they spit out a bunch of, oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, it, it's probably worth killing them, because then when she petrifies me, it doesn't really do anything right. Okay, here we go. That's worth it. Worth it. Boop. We can kill a couple of them. We can get petrified and not take damage. Ha <laughs> ha, okay. Please just turn into a head. Come on, last time when I ulted you, there you go. Okay, her head is toast, it's sinking. I probably don't want to touch that little skull bubble. Yeah, skull bubbles are probably bad. I would imagine all of that's bad. Crap, 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 no, not the skull bubble. Okay, skull bubbles are bad, we knew that. I'm just gonna hit her with a bunch of these. I feel like that's probably even better. Okay, and no, uh, oh, no, no, no! Ah, oh, it's so brutal, I need to line everything up. I need to be, yes! Yes, okay, I was gonna say I need to line up so that even if I do become petrified, I don't need to steer. I should still be able to get through. <laughs> she is my favorite boss so far. Just everything about her aesthetic is super cool and the way that she randomly generates almost different puzzles because you never know how they're gonna combine. Really like that one, even if I only got a B. Soul Contract of Gala Maria. And I'm starting to wonder if people are gonna enjoy this episode as much as the last one because I feel like people enjoy seeing me rage and become super salty over having fun and actually enjoying the game and beating it. <laughs> but before we move on, oh, I actually can't go up here. Right, okay. And I can't go through here. So I could go all the way back and around or I could try whatever this is. What are you? Rumor Honeybottom in Honeycomb Herald. So some kind of bee boss? I have no idea what this is, so I got rid of charge just to, oh yeah, giant bee boss. Oh yeah, look at that, oh hello. You look like you're straight out of goof troop. Um, yeah, I was gonna say that's really cool, the background, oh, it's even a bunch of little worker bees. I was gonna say, it looks like a bunch of little offices. So it wasn't an apartment building, it's some kind of strange office bee building, and I'm gonna randomly kill them. They're just on their way to work, man. They're doing their job. They, they don't want any trouble. This officer bee really needs to get off my nuts. There we go, you can just go away. We're gonna move on up in the world. All the little desks that the worker, what? What are you pointing at? Oh, oh, okay. Hello, Ms. Queen Bee. Uh, you're summoning your psychic balls, I see, just like a typical Queen Bee would. Uh, oh, come on, it's really hard to dodge them. I can't go up and down. Okay, so now you're coming over here. Gotcha, gotcha, all right. Spread is definitely a good decision. What is that? Um, okay, that wasn't so bad. It's a little bit awkward to see where that's going. Going down the middle, okay. I'm liking, what is this? What is, what is she doing? What is she doing? Is this some kind of weird hypnotic attack? Oh, she turned into a giant plane, what? You can't be a plane indoors, that's that's really rude. How do I hit you right, ah, I got, okay. I'm gonna hit her with my ultimate right now. Right, did that work? Okay, so she telegraphs her attack, I think, kind of, nope, nope, didn't see that telegraphed, I had no idea that was coming, no, mm, come on. She's like firing Voltron fists at me. It's a good first try. I think it's safe to say that I didn't anticipate the bee boss to become a fighter plane with saws. But then again, I can anticipate the police officer coming for me. So hopefully now I can do a little bit of damage before he uses his bee mines. I mean, I don't really get it. It's not even Valentine's Day, dude. You can't just ask people to be mine and now you're dead because of it. Okay, we did pretty good there. Didn't take any damage from him. Where are you going? 
Queenie, over there? That's what I like to see. Just telegraph it all to me. I do a lot of damage just sitting here. Uh, oh, oh, triangle. Triangle, okay. So it fires out the edges, and we're good. Um, I'm in a bit of a precarious position right here. We're, we're good. Um, what? We didn't see this one. What, what are you doing? Oh, 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 okay, okay. I, I don't, no, I don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm not even really hitting you a lot of the time because I'm busy focusing on your weird B missiles. We good? Oh, no, she's going over here. I got you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. We're doing a whole lot of damage just sitting here. I have to be just walloping on her right now. I should switch over to pea shooter and, oh crap, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no. We're good, we're good. Go away, you stupid thing. I need to get up. I need to I need to hit her with my ult now. Actually, that's a great idea because it does do damage, right? We're doing a crap load of damage to her. Yes, before she even became a jet, a plane, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so how, how do I, okay. Saw noises, saw noises are bad. There we go. I just, okay, please, just get, I need to focus on doing damage. Damage, damage, damage. No, don't jump into her cuphead, you moron. I, no, don't jump into the fist. We were so close. Oh, I hate that. I always do that where I'm ducking and then I want to jump and it doesn't register me standing up. So instead I d jump down into the boss or jump up into something that kills me in some cases. Just damn it. Oh. Why do you hit a knife and fork together when the battle begins? Like, I can understand the whole dynamic between worker bees and the offices, and she's the queen, she summons, like, the royal police on me, but I'm not on the dinner menu, am I? I'm a cup. You guys don't eat cups. And I'm pretty sure I'm not full of pollen or nectar or something like that. I'm pretty sure I'm full of milk or jizz. So, <laughs> I don't really get it. It doesn't really matter. I'm just gonna kill your secret royal police, and then we're gonna move on to killing you because I'm the bad guy in this situation. I just gotta focus on not taking damage and get a decent platform. There we go, okay. And we're moving on. Where you going, Queenie? Ma'am, I need you to understand that no amount of becoming a saw plane is gonna bring back your secret police. Okay, I squished them like a bug, like I squished you. I got her like right away. She transformed and died. You gotta do so much damage to her while she's in her form. I don't even think I said anything in the middle part there because it was the exact same. Ah, oh, sweet. Okay, I I'll admit. I took way more attempts than you guys are gonna see. If I took damage on the beginning police officer, then I would probably retry rather than go the whole way through with only two health, but still pretty cool. A little bit more frustrating. Not my favorite boss over today. God. You never know what to expect from these stupid bosses sometimes. Like, yellow apartment building. Uh, probably a giant fighter jet bee. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna go with. Soul contract of rumor honey bottoms. All right. And then that opened this, which brings us to another run and gun level and a very mopey looking gramophone. Hello, sir. Ach, that wolf gang always taking 10 notes to express two notes worth of music. He has no conception of what I mean by less is more. I know you agree with me. Go convince that tin eared clock. He won't listen to me anymore. Okay. So I need to go find a clock. Uh, there's another boss over here. You're not a clock. You look like a radio. So what if I go down and around? I want to see if I can get to that mausoleum before we end the episode. No, it doesn't look like I can get up there. I'm pretty sure something is going to get built right here if I beat Perilous Piers. Figured we could probably do one run and gun level every episode. It's like I said, I'm not a big fan of them, but if I need them to progress, then why not? We're running, we're gunning on the pier where there's probably a whole bunch of sea life swimming, flying around. <laughs> sure, why not? And some gross looking barnacle heads. Oh yeah, this is just a vacation spot if I've ever seen one. Hopefully we can manage to get through this with all the coins. I wouldn't mind picking up some more coins to pick up the other secondary shots. Holy crap, these guys are a little bit unpredictable. Silly little sea urchin, get out of here. And uh, we're, gonna, we're, we're gonna be just fine, just fine. So much crap getting thrown at me. Okay, so far so good. Nothing too out of the ordinary, except for the giant, oh, I can get on your back. 
I kind of assumed that was just reflex. <laughs> the giant random platform crabs. Cool. It's, it's kind of counterintuitive to this game, but it's very intuitive to other games. You know what I mean? Like, if you see a platform, you would try to get on it. I No, I don't want anything to do with you, but with this game, that isn't usually the case. I didn't mean to do that, I meant to dodge. Okay. Uh, cool. Screw me then. I guess, You know what? I'm just gonna run. I'm gonna run and gun and not fight and gun. Mm. Note to self, beware of Shrimp Jacques Cousteau's claws because they fire lightning, which is definitely not something that I am a big fan of. So we're just gonna, yeah, made that jump this time. That's what I'm talking about. He's coming back. He's coming back. No. Aha. Uh -huh. No, no. Aha, uh -huh, suck it with your lightning. Now how do I get over there? Oh baby, that's the stuff. We're running a, oh come on, I really needed to jump there. Okay, please, please tell me we're, oh there's a coin in there. So please tell me we're on the way. Is he done swimming over here? What is this? Oh, I don't, no, 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 okay. Mm, getting the coins, a little bit difficult. What the, there's no way. How do I do that? I need to jump and then parry and then blink. It's just, uh, it's just madness. Oh, Monsieur Cousteau, I would like to have a vote with you. Okay, there you go. And then you can take one of these right in your stupid buggy eyes. There you see, now you're dead. And I don't need to worry about you anymore. Because you're out of the picture. Oh, baby. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Oh, come on. Wait, what? Why is it, was it, how did he come back? You died. Oh, that is stupid. He's... <laughs> An immortal. Okay. Um. How do I? Okay. We're we're good. We're good. We're moving on. Oh my God! You're just gonna make my life difficult, aren't you? Okay. He's dead again. Three. Oh, I landed on it. Why did I fall after I landed? It doesn't make any sense. Oh my God! This is just brutal. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna land there. I'm gonna land there. And then this time I'm gonna. Uh, okay. Careful. And then there's no way. There's, there's, there's no way. I can't reach that without blinking. So how do I get the rest of the way? I'm getting back to here with my full health, but it's just not helping me in any way. So let's just go for it right away. I'm, I'm able to get this far, and then I need to keep, I need to keep parrying on. Do I need to land on him? Oh, I think I need to parry to get him going, and then I need to stay on his head. Head. Let's test out this theory. Oh my god, that's what it is. Okay, so now that we're up here, uh, okay, we just don't die, right? Um, no, no, where did you go? Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Do I need to keep this going? I think I need to keep this going, and then that stops him from sinking, right? Just, just don't, don't sink on me, bro. Don't sink on me, bro. Oh my god, that is so difficult. We almost made it. At least I know what I'm doing now. My god, this is more difficult than any boss I've faced today. So I'm guessing every now and then I need to hit it again. I don't want it to be blue for too long and I just need to keep shooting up to avoid getting hit by all the crap. Yeah, okay, when we get a free moment, we're gonna use that. All right, there we go. Okay, nothing above me. We're gonna do the jump. Just gonna keep shooting up. No, no, it's too much stuff. It's too much stuff. Okay, no. Oh my god. We're so freaking close every time. I actually made it back with three health this time. This is the first time I have done that. So, okay, yeah, that, that, that went by quick. But it still counts as three health, so if I don't beat it right now, I'm probably just gonna give up for the day. Oh my god, there's so much crap. There's so much crap, there's so much crap, okay. No, we're doing great. I'm not doing too great. Uh, great is a very subjective term. No, please, please stop jumping at me. Stop jumping at me, you stupid tramp. Okay, I am done. I can't get through this. I'm, my hands are crippled from all the bosses. Next, next time. But I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Cuphead, guys. I'm just, I've got gamer claw. I've been recording for two and a half hours and we got through all of the bosses like relatively quickly. 
But even then, if you try to get through two or three bosses in an episode, one run and gun level that gives you some trouble, some screwed up intros, some exploring, stuff like that, these videos take a long time, but they're still a lot of fun. And I'm willing to bet that there's only gonna be a couple more. Right, we probably have maybe three or four bosses left, and then what I assume would be either King Dice or the Devil or both. So I'm looking forward to seeing how Cuphead is gonna end. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.